Local. Late breaking. WVTM 13 News at 6 starts now. Well, just hours ago, American WNBA star Brittany Griner was freed from a Russian prison. Uh, good evening. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Ian Wright. And I'm Brittany Decker. Again, thanks for being here. The Olympian who spent nearly a year in jail was freed as a part of a prison swap. So you may recall uh, that's how two Alabama men were freed after being captured by Russian forces earlier this year. WVTM 13's Jeff Elisov spoke with the mother of Alex Drukey. That's one of the former prisoners about what Brittany might be facing when she gets back to American soil. Indeed. Bunny Druke spoke with me today on her sunny porch in Tuscaloosa. This is her reaction to Brittany Griner's release. I'm very happy for her family. But Bunny Druke, whose son Alex just returned from Russian captivity in September, offers words of caution to the Griner family. You just need to be patient and uh, don't push a lot. She'll heal in her own time, but you just need to be there ready with all the love that she's been missing. For Alex, the memories of captivity are too vivid to appear on camera for now. And his mother concedes. It took me quite a while to let him get out of my sight. Even now, when he goes off to the store alone or something, I think maybe I should go with him. Maybe he won't come back, you know, which is, is silly, but it's a, it's a form of PTSD. But now, as Brittany Griner heads home, I'm sure that Brittany's family and our family share a lot of the same feelings that you have worked so hard for this day and then it, for it to suddenly happen um, is just um, beyond belief. And beyond understanding the fickleness of fate. Like Thanksgiving was difficult for us because although we were really happy that our family were the lucky ones, there are families that are still waiting there in Ukraine for their loved ones to come back. And indeed, while there is much work to be done to free those other prisoners of this awful war, now heading into a deep, dark winter, one family has been made whole in the warm American South tonight. We're live in Birmingham. Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.